it's summer with seasons by summer and i am back again with another unboxing y'all the mailbox is busy i have been ordering things and getting things together for my fall planner needs this one was a i guess impulse buy because this is a mystery box that i purchased from a shop called nora's cove she has a big focus on budgeting um, from a you know for a planner girl or for it, women that are interested in keeping track of their budget so this is the mystery box budget box that i purchased from her i've also purchased some other just sticker sheets from her um, i like to use a lot of little small dot stickers to make lists in my planner so i purchased that from her a couple of like icon um, type stickers for holidays for amazon um, Think trash day, things of that nature. And so I have purchased um, from her for other things, but I have never gotten, I don't, I'm not a subscriber of her budget box, but this is a mystery box so I can check out and see what she's including in her subscription box so that I can determine if it's something that I want. So you know what? Let's dive right in. All right. So this is this was packed. When I got this, you guys, the sticker box was full. And so I really appreciate that. Everybody likes uh, receiving items and feeling like they're getting their money's worth. I think I paid, the sticker box was $45. All you have to do is just DM her to tell her that you're interested. And I guess as supplies last, she is doing mystery boxes. And it shipped really quickly because I believe that I purchased this maybe less than a week ago and it was here on time. So I think $45 plus shipping. So let's get right in because it's a lot of goodies in here. Okay, y'all. Where do we start? <laughs> I'm gonna move this over here to the to the right so that we can just focus on the items individually. So included in the sticker box are some pins, which I actually appreciate. Um, I used to have the pin inspiration uh, box from cloth and paper, but I stopped getting the pins because you know what? That's a lot of pins and I'm trying not to be too bad with getting items and not using them or collecting too many items. And so it looks like we have a 0.5 pin. I'm assuming it is in the color black. I don't have a pin test sheet here, but um, there's a 0.5 nib here. We've got another um, pin. I'm not sure. Oh yeah, pin here. So a little black pin. There is a more ballpoint type pin here with a cap. That's really lovely. Look how it looks, very stylish with a matte kind of look with gold um, trimmings around it. Then we have this other pin as well. I like this, I like the smooth uh, barrel of it. I like smaller pins too. I'm left-handed and then I have, you know, these long nails. And so I have to kind of keep track of how, keep, you know, that in mind when I'm dealing with pins. And then we have another um, pin here. I don't know what size this is. It's probably like a point, it's a 0.5 nib in the green cover, color. So I really like this because y'all know I love green. And so nice little set. I love it. Green is for money, but pins to get your finances in order. So great pin set. All right. She also includes, and I did see this in some of the sneak peeks, a budget box bag. This is her brand, the Budget Box, Budget and, and Plan and Confidence. I mean, who doesn't always need another satchel? I always need a bag uh, to grab and um, carry different items in. And so this is great. Probably it's a nice size. It's bigger than I thought it was going to be. Let's see, can y'all see that? So nice size, nice little uh, tote bag for you to use and carry items around as needed. It's a cute little budget bag there. All right. I've been wanting to know what this was, this little thing. I've seen it on a couple of her videos, and I'm like, what is this? I I feel like it's a desk pad, which is really nice. Let's get that open. La -la. I think so. Ooh, very nice. So a matte black. Some of this stuff out of the way so y'all can see it. very large very nice oh wow matte black pad it's really long it's extending past the video here y'all go okay here really long matte black desk pad i don't have one of these 
my desk is glass and so I could probably use this to write on it and it also comes with this like I guess um what do you call this um belt to go around it I guess to wrap it up if you need to pack it up so I really like that because you typically don't get this it rolls really well um and I guess you wrap this around and I may not have rolled it tight tight enough to do this but let's see if we can get this to do it so I didn't roll it tight enough but it has a nice little like belt class to keep the desk pad rolled up if you don't need it in use come on let's see if we can roll this tighter Come on, Summer, use your skills <laughs> to get this rolled up a little bit better. So let me try to roll this a little bit more tightly so that we can try out the class. All right, so I'll try it again. Yeah, that's a lot better. Okay. And it has three different, like, sizes. Oh, perfect. That is really, really nice. I like that. Okay. That's nice. Come on, Nora. Okay. Then we have a little bit of, I guess, journaling card, or um, you can use this part card in your um, planner to put like different colored dots. So it maybe like it's like a legend card, I guess. So if your debt items are, you're gonna code those with like some kind of red indication, indication to indicate debt, right? Negative. You can put that sticker there. Purchases are a certain color, loans, bills, budgets. So this is just a card that you can use as a legend to keep track of some of your finances. It has um, a little bit of the film on it to protect it, but uh, and you can tear that off. So it's really a crystal clear uh, type card. So really, really nice. I hope y'all can see that, but very nice. Okay. All right, we got a lot more stuff. Okay, so this looks like it's some kind of wallet. Think so. Okay, so a little card wallet here. Um, it's got six card slots. And then it has some other internal slots here that can be used. Very slim, nice um, leather, and then a nice um, kind of velvety type center. But something you can use if you need to like condense your wallet down to a smaller size um, if you need to put that in a smaller bag or a belt bag or some type of um, I don't know crossbody bag that's a lot smaller for like concerts and going to soccer games and stuff so you can use that for your bag all right and then we have a money clip or some type of clip I, I always appreciate anything that comes in gold right because I love gold so paper clip money clip um that can be used lovely there uh oh we've gotten a ruler a little small um five inch ruler that can be used i like this because i like to have smaller supplies to pack with my planner goodies that i take on the go and you know how you may want to line a uh, something up in your planner or draw a straight edge beautiful gold love that very classy very beautiful y'all i'm getting my money's worth for sure then we have a couple of stickers so these are some check mark stickers um it looks like let's see how many sheets we got i think there are two sheets of these check mark stickers so very very nice it's like a gray with Obviously, the black circle and black check mark. More goodies, okay. Then we have a sticky notepad that says spending tracker. So you can list the date, what was your total budget up here, the type, item, and amount, whether you spent cash or card, total expenses here, and then just some notes. And so this is a nice little sticky pad to use. Very nice, in a nice little brown color. That's beautiful we've got some sticky tabs so always can use this you can um put this in your planner like a lot of times you can put it on like if you have an inbox or something you can kind of uh, uh, use some glue dots to kind of take this down and have this so you can have these handy and with you on your in, in your planner as well so i like those little tabs 
Okay. Uh oh, we got two of the spending tracker sticky tabs. So very, very nice. A backup set. Or I got two. Y'all, there's still more, more stuff. And this was just $45, so this is not bad at all. A beautiful notepad. It isn't like a mushroom color with the gold notes with the grid lines. Oh, this is gorgeous. Very classy, very classy. Ooh, I can take this to like client meetings or use this to take notes. I really like this. I really like the color. It feels very smooth, y'all. I wish you could feel it. It just feels really good. Okay. I'm trying to not make this video too long. Okay. Okay. We have another kind of wallet slash pouch. So I guess this is a some type of pouch. It has a silver clasp. You can use this to slide your dollar bills, maybe your checkbook if you want to. It has the same interior as this other pouch as well, too. So you can use these to kind of like, or somewhat close, but to accompany each other um, if you have these in your purse. So this is really nice to slide uh, coupons or, I mean, you can put a lot of stuff in here um, and to keep things together and in a nice container. So I think these two items go together. We've got, um, looks like a little bit of a, uh, I guess a little binder. I think a lot of people use this for their cash envelopes. If you are into cash envelopes, so it's a binder uh, with six gold rings, nice rings, nice um, color of the binder. And then there are some, inserts that can be put into the cash envelope system so i may use this because i have some i don't use the cash envelope i burn through cash pretty quickly but what i do have are some like various like savings challenge kind of um inserts that i can put in here and then i can you know do a little game with myself to use the various savings challenges that i have and try to save up some cash for a particular item. I'm a big electronic banking person and I have this massive spreadsheet where I keep track of all my stuff, but it may be good for me to use this for, I probably will use this for my savings challenge to keep track of those and put that in here. So that's really nice. And I may need to get some more inserts. So really, really nice, Nora. Then we've got a sticky note tab. You know, you never can go wrong with sticky notes. You guys know what this is. I'm not gonna open this one. And then we also have some other sticky notes, again, kind of all in the same color family. So I appreciate her keeping that consistent for these mystery boxes. Another set of sticky notes. So to pay, bill, do. So if you need a, like a quick snapshot of what's to come as far as your bills, you can put this in your planner on a particular page. And that way you can check it off when you save that payment. So we won't open that. We've got another, another pouch. Girl, you are doing it up. Okay, so this one is more of a clear plastic pouch. You can put, y'all Y'all know we can always, us planner girls, there is always something we can find to put in here. So I'm, <laughs> I can include this in my work bag. So another beautiful pouch um, for items to put. You can put pins in here. Let's see if these pins fit enough room to put some sticky tabs in here you, let's put our little sticky note in here y'all everything is fitting here look out look at that oh giving life okay almost done guys almost done let's see what else she gave another y'all this is a beautiful color scheme look at these sticky tabs okay let's put this in our pouch look at that the blue, green, mauve, tan. And then these are more of a lighter, like the grays, and then a little bit of pink. And fits perfectly in our pouch. Look at, look at the pouch. Giving. Another sticky note. This is just for notes, but another sticky note tab. Y'all know we love those. And then the last thing I think that's in here um, is a clip pad. I like this because I can keep this 
and not talk when I'm opening. I can keep this on my desk. Oh, that's cute. You can put a pin. Oh, let's see, let's see. Oh, y'all. I didn't know what I was getting into. Girl, Nora, this is so nice. You can put a pin in there. Oh, look how cute that is. And then you put your pad. So let's open this up. She gave another pad, a monthly brain dump pad. I'm actually for real going to put this on my desk because I am a big brain dumper. Um, I usually have it electronically, but you have your pad here. And it's not a sticky pad, but that's totally fine. But you have your brain up here. You can write on here. So let's say if I am putting the month of, what is this month? Let's take this off of a pen so we can write with it. October. And then a goal for this month is to save, save, save. You can put the monthly calendar here i'm loving this and then tasks you can write down tasks or goals or whatever but this is just a, a a place for you to capture everything that's going on in the month so that is really nice okay y'all it's just so much i'm just like it's like christmas already in october and then she included a couple of our journaling cards so she has a journaling card on how to grocery shop on a budget hmm, i need this and i need to read this every time i go <laughs> She has her logo, or, or sorry, another drawing card, a larger one, Gold Crusher. So this is nice with some lines on the back. And then obviously her thank you card. So this is how you can find Nora's Cove. This is her Instagram, Facebook, YouTube, as well as her website. Y'all, I got, I wasn't sure what I was going to get. I was looking at some of the other Instagram videos that she had. And I was like, oh, I hope I get that. But she has exceeded my expectations with this box so reach out to her if you have it yet and get you one of these so you are not missing out all right well that's all i have for today if you liked the content that was here please don't forget to like the video subscribe or follow whether this is on instagram or uh youtube as well as leave me a comment and let me know what you guys think let me know if you're gonna invest in one of these boxes with Nora's code all right i look i'm glad i got a chance to talk to you guys today you guys have a great evening or afternoon or morning wherever you are and i will see you guys on the next video talk to you later Bye bye